Hi guys and welcome to TechBased. In this video, we're gonna talk about a better search alternative for Windows 11. In our daily use, if you use the Windows 11 search, well, sometimes we encounter some issues. For me, the main issues would be that the Windows search, if you're trying to use it to search online, for example, it will only use the Bing search engine and also the Edge browser. So I don't like that about the Windows 11 search. And besides that, the Windows 11 search is sometimes slow and doesn't give you the best search results. So in this video, I'm going to show you a search alternative for Windows 11. It could be better than the default search from Windows 11. But of course, that is for you to decide. Before starting this video, please don't forget to leave a like on this video and also subscribe to the tech base channel because it helps me out a lot. Before continuing the video, a quick message from our video sponsor. This video is sponsored by keysfan.com. Keysfan offers cheap and legal OEM software keys, which are 100% genuine. This is their product page, which features special offers for Windows 10, 11, and also Office 2021 licenses. The best offer on the website, in my opinion, would be the Windows 10 Pro license, which is $15, but using my coupon code, you'll be able to get half of this price. Just click on Add to Cart to get it, and then click on View Cart. In the right side, click on Apply Discount Code, and use the discount code TB50 for a 50% discount, and the final price for the Windows 10 Pro key will be $758. You can click on Proceed to Checkout, and you'll have some payment methods, such as credit card or PayPal. Check out keysfan.com from the links below in the description and get your Windows or Office license today. In this video, we are going to talk about Flow Search. Flow Search is a quick file search and app launcher for Windows. And the most important thing is that it is open source. As you can see, you can also install it using the Windows terminal, but we're going to download it from GitHub. You're going to have this link in the article below in the description, and then you can just go ahead and click on download from GitHub. And of course, download the latest version. Scroll down a bit and go and download the exe file. I'm just going to run it and install it. On the Microsoft Defender smart screen, click on run anyway, and it will be automatically installed silently and you'll have a shortcut on your desktop. Also, we're going to have a welcome screen where we can select our language. Of course, I'm going to leave it on English and then go and click on next. And you're going to have to select a flow launcher hotkey so that the launcher or the search box will appear when you press a certain combination or a key combination. I think I like Alt plus space. I'm going to use it and then go ahead and click on next. And also here you have other hotkeys. So for example, back in context menu and the arrows and so on, you can just go ahead and study these hotkeys for a bit and click on next. Also, you're going to see that you have some nice additions for the flow launcher search. You have action keyword and commands. You basically can search the web launch applications or run various functions through flow launcher plugins. And of course, you can just install those plugins. Certain functions start with an action keyword and if necessary, they can be used without action keywords. Try the queries below in Flow Launcher. Basically, you can use these in the Flow Launcher and you'll be greeted with a result in a Google browser or in your Windows settings. So just go ahead and click on next and we can select Start Flow Launcher and System Startup and then click on Done if we like it, of course. Now, let's test it out for space and this is Flow Launcher. As you can see, it looks really, really nice. So let me search for File Explorer. As you can see, easily I have two search results. I can search Google or I can open up the file explorer from Windows. I can also use the shortcuts Alt plus one or Alt plus two. Let's open up the file explorer from Windows. As you can see, it is really, really simple. I think I like it a lot. And I can also search Google basically with some keywords. A nice thing about this launcher is that you can also search through your apps, settings, control panel, and whatever. So for example, let's search for Bluetooth. As you can see, we have here both results from the new settings app and also from the old settings app and the new settings app results are prioritized. So basically they appear on the first row. So if we click on it, we will be greeted with this result. Let's also test out the file search. So I'm going to look for a file. As you can see, I type a file name and instantly, almost instantly, I get the result with my file name. Of course, I have a weird file name for that picture, but you can use other keywords and other searches. Of course, if you right click on it, you'll be able to go into the settings. And here you have a whole bunch of settings that you can personalize. Of course, I'm not going to talk about them in depth, but you can go ahead and look for plugins and you also have a plugin store that is also really nice. It is a very, very nice app that I said the best thing about it is that it is open source so everyone can contribute to it. We also can change the theme. So for example, I'm going to choose the dark theme. As you can see, also the app is optimized for Windows 11. We have the rounded corners and so on. We have the hotkeys. We can even add hotkeys if we want. HTTP proxy, basically this app also allows blacklisting and of course we can 
can see here the version we can check for updates and so on i already have the latest version also let me select a theme from here so for example i'm going to select black and white from here from the theme section and let's see how it looks as you can see it looks something like this i think this is really really nice and in my opinion it's a very nice addition to windows 11. of course uh, even if you install this application you can always use the windows 11 search but use the hotkey that you selected for it to be enabled but what i like about it is that it is really really fast you can search for things really really fast and you're gonna see that everything is very well categorized and prioritized in order of the priorities that windows 11 sets so as i've said if you want to download flow launcher you can download it from the link below in the article and make sure to leave a comment below to say your opinion about this of course, I didn't talk about it in depth, but you can do your research and change a whole bunch of settings that will help you improve the experience altogether. And of course, don't forget to play with the plugins. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the tech base channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. Don't forget that all the links necessary are in the article below in the description. I was Emmanuel from TechBase. Until next time, have a nice day.